four, three, two, no, 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 no. We okay. don't have a jingle yet, but we have a new fucking haircut, don't we, there, General? No, it's actually not. Haircut. It's not a haircut. It's just a different style. Oh, it's a hair racing style. the curls. Ah, uh, okay. the Puerto Rican curls. I yes. feel that. The curls. There you go. I feel that. <laughs> General's Puerto Rican or half Puerto Rican, if you guys didn't know. A lot of things. Oh, they, they said that's not what defines him. Uh, music producer is also another thing that doesn't define him, yeah. obviously, because here we are, uh, episode number four hundred. Max, listen, like we it, don't know, we don't, we don't mix, we don't mix, we don't mix the the production of the producer and then the the gamer. Uh, two different people. Two different. I get that. Yeah, 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 yeah. All three egos and all. What's your know. wait? What's your Producer name. That's a secret. <laughs> <laughs> do, wait, do you, do you do you have shit on Spotify right now? Man, yeah. maybe, maybe secret. That's do you he's, know. He's, he's marshmallow. Huh? He's Never marshmallow. Know. We just don't know. Oh my god! Never. Imagine this whole time that I can't see. He's him. You do know Skrillex. How do you know Skrillex? I don't know so Skrillex. Man, just, you don't know. I don't <laughs> know. Too much information. Anyway. Uh, if there are any music producers out there that would like to create a paid opportunity, mind you, I don't know how to do this. How do you do it? Because I don't want them to go out there and be like, oh, I'm making music, and then be like, not get picked. And then they're like, they just did a whole bunch of work. I mean, you just have, you make a whole video reacting to a bunch of different ones, so they get the promotion for it, and then you pick the best one, and then pay that guy. Smart thinking. God damn it. That's the way you That's do the things. Man. Anyway. Welcome to the Florida Mutineers Home Series pre-show. Let me rephrase that. Let me rephrase that. Let me start over. Welcome, welcome, welcome to... Where are we? Fuck. Are you good? I'm having another aneurysm <laughs> part in my head. Holy shit. I did have one of those earlier. Anyway, uh, welcome to the Florida Mutineers Home Series, brought to you by the Optic Pre-Show. Brought to you by Mavix Chairs. Okay? They're meshy at the bottom, so you can let loose as many of those gases as you want without them being trapped in a cushioned environment. That's a good promo. It is. I like that. Thank you. Swamp ass, non-existent. <laughs> changed my life. It changed your life. I used to be King Swamp. Yeah. Now I'm King Freedom. King, King Freedom. Freedom. General, how have you been? <laughs> I've been fine. Just grinding in challengers. Like how's the world of the how's the underworld? Underworld. Going? The underworld. <laughs> it's it's always great. Like it's like you know that one game um, on mobile where like you have to like you're like the virus and you have to like destroy the world. Yes, it, that, that's how Challengers is. It's like, it's like, it's like <laughs> you say yes, like, like yes. I played it. I did like a YouTube oh, series. Yeah, oh, it was like mobile though. It was like whenever I think of speed. Challengers, I think of like that Plague? game. Is that what it's called? Yeah, yeah, I think Plague? of like Plague there's like something some new shit. every single like week. Like something new happens. Yeah, People like something controversial. Like what's the controversy I, this week? Um, I don't know. It's like someone breaks a GA, like mm. like bad host issues, like deliberately like pulling up twenty tabs on YouTube, watching streams while hosting on Wi-Fi when you're agreeing <laughs> to fiber the host. Like, do you just get oh, blacklisted if you break GA? Like, what is the? I, I mean, I don't know. Like, there's just something new. Like, like the guns. Like, there's like a a spring coil AK74U, which is like. It doesn't do anything to the rec recoil of the gun, yeah. but it's a, since it's a variant, it changes the way that it, like, um, like, you know when you shoot a gun, like the XM4, like, the dot will, like, shake, yeah, yeah, yeah. but it has nothing to do with, like, your aim. It's just yeah. the gun, like, yeah. so the 74U coil, like, doesn't have visual, like, bounce. No sway? You yeah, it kind of okay. like that. Yeah. And, like, the gun just beams. Like, yeah. it's different from, like, the 70 actual... So That's like I don't know, people are like complaining about not using variants mm. or not using or using variants because you know, you know like the Dragon Craig and yeah. all that stuff like yeah. there's variants in the game. So like are they, people are using the toy one, the Santa special. Yeah, I don't know if you guys know what that one is. It's like the baby. Uh, it's like the baby's version of the 74U. It's like the elf one. I don't know if you know what that one is. No. I yeah, can't remember. Like, I know. I mean, I know all the other ones. Yeah, about. It's I don't a, know that one though. Like it doesn't do anything with the recoil, but it makes it to where like you can see people better. And because it's actually yeah, a smaller, yeah, it's literally, gun. Like a, it's literally like a little baby, like gun, but it still shoots, like, yeah, bullets that yeah. hurt people, yeah. <laughs> that sounds fun. I don't know. It's like there's just so many different things that it's like <laughs> so not, uh, not civilized and not, um, so there's nobody, pro, aren't there pro players in that thing? 
What for challengers? Well, they don't. Well, they're not the ones you really worry about. It's just like it's the other. Ones. Yeah, the it's other the ones, ones that are in the, the snakes yeah. in the grass. Yeah. yeah. So there's nobody true. like there's no like like a, there's no like there's nobody like watching over this like well, like an official or anything. Yeah. Is there no no? I mean, is there no vods on this? What do you mean? Like, are there vods from people streaming like breaking rules and doing like scumbag shit? Uh, yeah, but like people don't really talk about it because it's like, what you're just gonna complain like. That's what I don't get. There's nothing like when, in terms of GAs. Like, like in Wester, like 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 when Wester won in the beginning of this game. Like I always like make fun of uh, like the quote I always used to hear because uh, Paul would put us on like a 120 ping host and then we would lose like you know maps one and three because that's what they hosted. But then we would lose this our search and our host and he's like, well, you should have won the search and destroy. Mm. Like who cares? You like you gotta you gotta go game five. I'm like, you know what? He's right. But at the same time, like I got no chance. Well, at the same on time, host. like they're still lagging. Like they're still like skipping. Y yeah. All I'm saying is if, if you're a trained professional gamer at 120 ping and you're good, you're going to be good no matter the circumstances because you're yeah. still going to be in, the, in that reality yeah. where you're, you're, you're a Wi-Fi player. No, wi that's what I'm saying, though. That's why I agree. Like, yeah, I got to win the search, I guess, on my host and take it to game five at that point. I'm glad you Do have you? that mentality because I yeah. certainly did. I get pissed when no, people No, I mean, I get, I get mad in the moment, but I just look at it like this is what we're playing. You were like the... You were like the king of playing on bad hosts. Oh, it was the best. Yeah, that, really oh, yeah. That's all, I mean, when I was in Michigan, I, I, I remember fiber. people talking yes. about that. Like, yeah, because you yeah. guys would lose every scrim and then you'd win the the land. That yeah, doesn't just, really happen anymore. Yeah, because everyone's. I mean, you think about the internet's that we used to have. Like everyone in Horrible. general used to have in, you know, 2010 to 2013. I was like, on Wi-Fi up until like I started hanging out with pro players. Yeah, same. And it was like not until I moved to Texas. Yeah, it's really just not yeah, the same I, anymore. I, Everybody has like a good Michigan connection. Really yeah. There's nobody like, like three barring. But do you remember like is... good connections back in the day were like a hundred, a hundred down. A yeah. hundred down was like mind blowing. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And now it's like a hundred. Oh. If you don't have a thousand, thousand, like if you don't have a thousand up. Yeah. yeah. No, and then, challengers yeah. though, everyone like oh, there's a lot of players that don't like don't have fiber. Really. So like what happens is is like they you try to agree to like neutral fair hosts, but what happens is that they try to give you like a centralized. Um, cable host, right? But yeah. then you give them a fiber, and it's, that's just not fair because, like, a cable player can connect well to a fiber player, but a fiber player can't con connect well to a cable because, like, you're bringing them down. So people will, like, will just threaten people with cable hosts. Like, are we doing, like, this and that, like, what? centralized? Like, <laughs> yeah. Bro, I am mind blown. That's, <laughs> that's, why I ask him, that's why I ask him. <laughs> what, what, no. what is going you on in the underworld? You threaten people with cable hosts, and then you try to figure out a centralized location. No, no, like that. You just pick up somebody from Arkansas pro. and let them host. <laughs> no, like and people literally. We got cousins to play cards. Even, even yeah. in the past, I've literally played against players that deliberately switched over their lines when they hosted and went to a hot spot and then switched their fiber lines to play on my team toe. Play so the game, bro. Line. Psychological That's crazy. warfare. It's like. That's crazy. Like the, That's what Aix used to do. Bro, like. <laughs> Did he? Aix, dude, Aix's connection. <laughs> He has the he, worst he, host. I you can can't kill him. Like even, like even last year, played in like. That's what I mean. We played in like a Modern Warfare 2 throwback. He hosted and dropped 70 kills. Yeah. 70 kills on Scrapyard. That's what I mean. Like, if you're a good fucking player and you're used to playing on a certain connection, yeah. you have an advantage. Oh, yeah. You know even what on you their can, host, you're still moving differently. You know what you can challenge and what you yeah. can't. And you know when you can win, when you can't, like, can't lose a gunfight. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. That's, I'm, I'm so <laughs> interested, interested in that world because it reminds me, and I always say it, chat, stop. I know you guys say it. Spartacus, okay. In the show Spartacus, have you watched it? No. You should. There's really? A, there's a lot of nakedness that happens. Oh, I'm in. I'm in. Well, no, I'm just gonna say like oh. on both sides. Oh, I'm double in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, both sides. Hot dudes, hot girls. Have you seen The Witcher? Was <laughs> <laughs> that <I> pause? <laughs> have you seen The Witcher? No. Nah. Dude, you should watch The Witcher. Just why? Same thing. <laughs> same thing. No. Yeah. <laughs> no. Spartacus is like super, super gruesome though. Really? Like yeah, like limbs like go three hundred. Huh? Like no, 300. worse. But there is a thing uh, you should watch it. If you got guys, press one. If you guys have watched Spartacus and you agree, movie or TV show? It's a TV show. TV show. Like okay. the thing is, oh my god, you watch it and then go watch the documentary of the dude that died doing that. For real? Oh my god, such a sad story. Oh my god, such yeah, see, a good I'm, show. Right now, I'm in like the I want to watch happy shit mentality. I think it's because of Ted Lasso. Lasso. Yeah. So now I'm watching Shit's Creek and like I'm just kind of in that like, let's not be sad before I go to bed. I like that. Vibe, you know. Yeah. 
I started watching murder documentaries for a while before bed. I had to stop that shit. Mm-hmm. It was like a two week span. I was watching um, what's his name, Lieutenant Joe Kinder or something. It's like <laughs> Lieutenant Dan. <laughs> Great Lieutenant show, Dan, but... the serial killer shit with his fucking wheelchair. Like, <laughs> like a lieutenant. He comes uh, I, 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 I think. Wait, me. where is that? Is that a um, fictional thing or is it a no? Documentary no, he was like a real homicide detective in Colorado, and he like narrates all the cases that he went through, and it shows like reenactments. Know, Great are... show, but it. It fucks you up. Yeah. Especially yeah, before yeah. bed. Like, you don't want to be... Like, I watched the night soccer thing before bed, and I was like, why the, the fuck what? did the I do night that? Soccer? The night soccer? It's a... Dude. Uh, night stalker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's with, uh, so good. Yeah, the movie, right? No. It's the documentary about the night soccer. Like, the dude who, like, terrorized LA for no, a while. No, no. I didn't... It's fucking crazy. Wait, is this the one where he was running around just shooting people in the cars? No, is that, that a is Son, Son of Sam. Yeah, yeah. Son of Sam. Watch that one, too. The one that was definitely good. The most inventive one was definitely Don't F with Cats. The last dude, dude, that, dude, bro, that, that shit. One, Wait, what? That, that, that one fucked me up. a weirdo, bro. That, that one I, fucked I, me I up. Didn't, I, didn't watch me because I didn't know what it was. I don't like cats. So I'm like, I'm not. No, you don't should watch that. You, dude, dude, it is wild. nuts. Yo, I heard the one that was scary was that, that one hotel in LA that's haunted where that one lady. Elisa like, Lamb? Yeah, that one's good too. I actually. Because uh, I knew about the Elisa Lamb. This is so. This is a pre-show. Uh, I knew yeah, about yeah. the Elisa Lamb thing like a long We're time ago. We're turning into a podcast. And uh, and then I watched that documentary. And actually, like, it like answers a lot of questions that the if you, you if you knew about the case prior, because it like went viral a few times. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. I knew about it, but yeah, that's a good one too. Don't fuck with cats, though, dude. That Don't fuck with cats. That guy is a weirdo. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'm, not watching it. I'm not watching it. I'm not watching it. It's not my thing. Anyway. So last week's matches, obviously, yes. uh, we 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 had uh, no, we were one one for two. We all called. Well, we were yeah one for two. We said that we were going to win against Face. Yep. The thing is this: it's like I've seen them play against Face, and I don't know what it is, but the second that we get on stage, yeah, you know, like the some, lights, huh? <laughs> it's the lights. No, <laughs> the, the lack thereof. No, I don't know. I don't. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I don't know what it is. But anyway, we didn't have no, the, the it, greatest. They're on a run right now. Huh? Phase is on a run right now, yep. and we're just getting back into the swing of things. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Could have been a crazy momentum boost for us, but I don't think anyone is, like, devastated by it. No, you know what's crazy about this one time? Like, like, we did go outside, and they were talking over and over again. Yeah, it got heated on a couple of things. Really? Not heated, like, well, not heated the way that Tactical Rap's going to make it seem on the video that he makes, <laughs> but heated enough to where it was just like, well, you should have done this. So they, ah, ah, ah. And then immediately after that, we get upstairs, they get here. They sit down and they're just laughing at, at that. Yeah. I, I think you were watching, right? Some of the... Yeah, well, I mean, I, I just think you just... A, it's just not overthinking it and just... I mean, these guys are champions, right? Yeah, so yeah, when, yeah. It, when it yeah. goes down to playing the game, you just got to just go out with whatever it is your mindset is. Like, game plan, just follow it is what it is. Yeah, Don't yeah, overthink yeah. it. Who yeah, cares if it stays the best teamwork slash, you know, talented team, whatever at the moment. Like, yeah. Is what it is. Yeah, you just gotta yeah, just that's wild. It got heated though. I didn't know it got heated. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, it didn't. It wasn't not heated. like heated, heated. But like, yeah, they, not, you I nev- wasn't taking a dig at, at, at rap. He's good people. You like never. You like never see this. This is like the only team, the only team I've ever seen since I've been working at Optic that ne- they never butt heads. It doesn't seem. Yeah, like. no. I mean, they disagree a lot. But, right. You right. know, this time it was like, well, you, you should have done this, and then somebody said, well, no, it couldn't have worked that way because of this. It's like, no, 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 no. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah. And I was just, I was sitting there. I'm like, all right. Well, it's, it's all on camera, obviously. Like, yeah. we'll, we'll, we'll one day, hopefully, the process will come out one day. <laughs> Episode, what is it? <laughs> what, two? <laughs> Episode two. Like, come on. Yeah, yeah Raj. <laughs> I'm kidding. Anyway, nobody's so, talking about him either. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyway, as soon as that, as soon as that comes out, like, people will know what I mean. It wasn't, it wasn't as bad as, uh, <laughs> it, it wasn't like a heat out But again, like, the, the mentality when it comes to that, like, they know that they have, like, the, the right tools. It's just a matter of how they sharpen them to go against that one team. And look, that one team is fucking legitimately good, right? It's not like they're just getting lucky, right? Like, they're doing it over and, and over and over again. Incredible, yeah. Uh, but I don't know. It's just it's just uh, one of those things where you just have to wait and see. We have land the next uh, four or three events, uh, or the three the next three finals are going to be on land, which is going to make it, you know, super good. So, wait, is it only, is it three more finals or two finals and then champ? Two finals on the champ. Holy and shit. all three are going to be land? Yeah, I think oh. so, right? Wow. I haven't been on I wonder any... If, I wonder if champs is going to have... you think any of them are going to have fans or no? I hope that champs does. I, Dude, hope, yeah. I, I got my... Va- oh, I got my vaccine. I saw your... Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. got one of them. We got the Moderna or whatever? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. Wait. What's happening here? I have, like, scales. You went left? <laughs> the 5G. <laughs> 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 yeah. Uh, somebody got mad at me. 
when I posted that, they're like, I can't believe I followed you. You got a vaccine. I'm like, uh, I also had my tetanus shot. <laughs> you were cool with me then, prick. <laughs> anyway, uh, we're going to take it to, oh, look, usually we do a, a COD corner, right, with you as the host, and then the boys ask a question. We wanted to give them a break from that, so instead we had them do something fun. They have to look for the fun, though. We're going to kick it over to Prop Hunt with the boy. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Sethi Says. Today, we're going to be playing some Prop Hunt for the pre-show. I haven't played hop Prop Hunt in a minute, but it should be some fun looking for each other in some public match games. So let's get into that shit right about now, and let's not waste any time. Brandon, look, Brandon is a space eater top floor. <laughs> nah, bro, I got a godlike spot, bro. Cops, cops, cops. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? Just like in search. Dude, I turned to look at Brandon and just died. <laughs> Wait, are you on the run? Oh, I see you. You're on the run, brother. Even though change. Oh. You're so dead. You're so dead. This is some finesse. Oh my god, they don't know what's happening around them. Oh my god, dude, how are you still up? Dude, Lady Arsena can't see you. Wait, you're about to get trapped underground. Oh my god, you just got played, dog. What are you? I need a table. No! Brother, you're getting blasted. Nah, look at him, oblivious, bro. Oh wait, she's slide canceling. Yeah, you're fucked. Wait. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god, he's coming back. He's coming back. Here, the whistle. There's no way they don't shoot you, right? Oh, my god. He's a trash can. Oh, no. Yo, change it, change it. Oh, you suck. Alright, where are these clowns? I found one already. I know, I know like, the back of my head. <laughs> That's not there. Whoa! Got one! Haha, <laughs> strictly. Strictly ass. Oh, what's on the run? Got two. Got two. I'm, I'm getting finessed. I just got finessed. Dude, what, what the fuck is this thing? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, this guy's got to get out of here. Yo, this guy is he's costing. Oh, oh my god. god. Dude, he's literally throwing. He's not serious. What the hell? Oh my god, they're on me. Oh. Oh, I'm on the move. Damn. You got a lot? Wait, yo, I just made a play, Bruce. <laughs> You're so, like, out of line, dude. No! 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 Dude! 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 The other one's over here somewhere. Nice! Oh, nice. nice. Your ass! Yeah! <laughs> I'm all the way in their base, dog. Oh, not dog. Just swindled these kids. One. Wait, so this hard. guy left. This guy left in the back of this one. Oh. Uh, you probably need some sir. That guy has literally the negative aim. Wait, how many? How many views are you? Dude, just let me sound whore, dude. Are you kidding? No, He's a chair. Or you lose. Like, <laughs> like you're on a cliff. He's a brother. random chair. On yeah, the you're, you're dead. Look at you. Oh my god, finesse oh, shit. Oh, oh, oh my god. He broke his ankles. Dude. Oh, you're dead. oh no. Oh decoy, my god. Decoy, 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 oh, decoy. Decoy, decoy. Nice. Oh my god, dude. You're, off the, you're, you're out of there. Oh. oh my god. Assassinate him. Oh my god. They're dude. Oh, god. <laughs> and that'll do it for the prop hunt segment of this video. We absolutely just mopped the competition. Two and, two and zero in our games. I mean, it really doesn't get much easier than that. And we'll see you guys in the next one. 
And we're back. Look, as you guys saw there, right? At least they're having fun. Have you ever played Prop Hunt? Um, Gary's Mod? Gary's like, Mod, yeah, no, yeah. I haven't played the original. No. Seen a lot of videos, though. Sea Nanners videos are great. Yeah, Sea yeah. Nanners. I mean, uh, the, the, what is it? What's Vanos Cruz? Yeah, the, like, the Alpha Betas guys. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah, I don't know if they're called the Alpha Betas. Yeah, they, I mean, I mean, I they, they think they were. The Alpha betas, they were like the Gary's Mod. Yeah, the Gary like, Mod. Yeah, the guys <laughs> that invented it. Vanos wrote the code <laughs> yeah. for like that group, and made the music. And made the music. Because, you know, he makes music. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, made the music. <laughs> all right. So we have uh, the World Series of Warzone after the first land. So, Hell yeah. Uh, do we know when the, do we know exactly the dates of the Dallas uh, land? The 7th or something? 16th through the 18th of... Of... June, hmm. yeah. Three so weeks. in two weeks, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. in two weeks, we are going to have the first land, and then the week after that is when the World Series of Warzone uh, comes out. Now, here yeah. are the rules. The so, is this is what Damon was talking about last yeah. week. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. This, so this is going to be Damon, uh, Seth, and and uh, and formal, okay? and Blake and George, and, and Blake and someone George, else. and someone else. What? Do you know who? Uh, we're going between three people right now. You don't want to say yet. Well, we don't know. Uh, between those three. <laughs> which, you don't want to say the three? No. Oh, okay. So you don't want to say. Just in case. Wait, you're not yeah. playing? No. Oh. Why, why aren't you playing? Same reason Will's not playing. Just don't play. I just don't play. <laughs> <laughs> I can understand that. <laughs> oh, man. I wish I played more. Uh, all right. So we have uh, $300,000 for trios. It's a, trio, it's a trios game. The scoring is one point <laughs> equals one kill. Yeah. The first... Kill, oh no, first place equals 2x points, which means that if you get 15 kills and get first place, that's 30, 30 points. points. Yep. Okay. Crazy. Uh, if you land in second through 15th, it's one and a half points, which means that if you come in 15th and you had two kills, that equals three. Hmm. Some real strategy behind that. Because, like, do you go for first place? Because the difference in. For like double points or 1.5 points, is it really that yeah. different? I think yeah. I'd rather just be like 15th place and get a lot of kills instead of risk it all True. and go for first. I mean, I mean, but like, in order, I mean, it really it just depends. I mean, but if you get 10 kill, if you get 10 kills and you get like below, you know, if you whatever, get 16, kills and you got 15th place. I mean, if you, you drop in points. hot, if you drop in hot and then your team, like as a collective, you have 15 yeah. with like... You should go for the dub. Yeah, at you that need to point, go for you need dub. to calm down, in my opinion. Yeah. Like at that point, yeah. because then... Yeah, like stop rushing people yeah. and right, play right, for the right, win. Right. Then. Yeah. Like maybe go for snipe knocks and yep. things. I bet you there's going to be a lot of people sniping. Yeah, well... It's going to be fun. I'm, I'm excited to watch it. I am so excited to watch it. I right? can't wait to have a watch party and... Yeah. Same. For 300 k too? For $300,000. I don't know how it breaks down. Do we know the price breakdown as to first? We don't yet. But I do think that that's going to be a good one. Uh, well, second to 15th, one and a half points. 60 to the 15th to 50th is 1x points. That's going to be crazy. So that is going to be, bro, it's going to be one of the nuttiest I hope, things. I hope it works. I hope they test the shit out of it. Yep. Because. Zero chance that they don't. Because. I oh mean, you got to think the first Fortnite event that they ever tried it, it was a lag fest. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, the thing is, is they did this at CDL, like with COD players last yeah, year. Yeah, yeah. So and that went smoothly. So Wait, for the do most they play part. against pubs? Is no. it pub? No, oh, so it's, it's everyone, lobby. Okay. everyone in one lobby. That's yeah. good. Okay, so now they're having like personalities and shit, right? Like Personalities. Is, is Nate shot playing? Brax player. I think, Nate, I think Nate got an invite. Well, I mean, yeah, he definitely got an invite. I don't know if he's playing though. I wonder if Hector got an invite. I'm sure you can email one person and you'd be good. Yeah, no, I, I just don't play enough. Otherwise, you know, if I did, I can compete, but I don't. Uh, as I was saying, I think that it's going to be dope because there's going to be a lot of, like, we're going to get to see, like, the super good fucking Warzone players that are, like, the symphonies of the world. Like, when Symphony, who was, it, who was the team? Symphony, Seth, and who? And Diesel? Diesel, Their yeah, partner, yeah. Bro, Symphony is a nasty boy on that fucking map. Yeah. Disgusting, right? Now we people don't have, that can aim like that just don't make sense to me. Like yeah. Symphony, Tifu, like people that like can snap. Yeah, just doesn't look real, bro. You know the Symphony wild plays keyboard mouse. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the wildest thing out of all of that is that I didn't really. Re I mean, I always known right because I watched people play, but it wasn't until I was spectating formal and I've spectated Scump and I've spectated everybody, but it wasn't until I spectated formal 
in Modern Warfare on fucking uh, Gunrunner, where I was just like, bro, I could not fuck, I could not Dude. in my brain understand. There's such a different level. The process. Like one, one day, like uh, we were playing here and it was a, a new update. And this just, this, we did this like last week and Bruce came in. I was like, Bruce, you wanna play, uh, you wanna play League? And he was like, sure. And he had just eaten, he was chilling. And then he sat down and we, we played and he tried the far out. I was like, like, there's just such another level. Yeah. It's fucking insane. What's, what's wild about that too like, is like when, when I posted the clip of him, uh, of, of uh, Dashy sniping, right? Yeah. And it's like, oh, it's bots. I'm like, I don't think you understand. Dude, that clip is insane. It it doesn't, just because it's so. like the 30 for, it's like he didn't go 30 for 30, but it's like essentially. He what? went like 29 for 30 against bots. And he was just, he was in one spot on Black Ops 3, and it was just pop, pop, pop. And then he'd boost up and pop. And it was just like, he was hitting everything. Every shot, bro. He didn't miss a single fucking shot with the sniper. And people are like, oh, it's bots. They don't shoot back. Uh, you, uh, listen, go into, into the, into go the shooting that. range. <laughs> into the shooting range within game. Right. Not even getting half. Call it's like, it's like half. Even, yeah. pe- even people that all they do is snipe would be yeah. were impressed by that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Except for Pomage. I bet you Pomage. Come on, he, he, he tipped it. He tipped he, the hat. Yeah, he did. Um, I, I, I do think that there is, we're going to see the keyboard versus, uh, you controller. know, keyboard versus controller. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm excited. I, love I, do, that I shit. cannot literally wait. What I am going to be upset about a little bit is the fact, like the viewership, right, in comparison to what we get in CDL is going to be, <laughs> oh, it's gonna be different. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's going to be a lot yeah, different. Yeah. But, but then again, it's like, you 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 have these sort of instances in which you have, like we have to do that in private lobbies, which is good. Like I want that to yeah. be a thing. Mm-hmm. The problem with that is that you're gonna have, you know, the Tim the Tapmans, the Doctor Disrespect, the uh, I mean, you name it, the Ninjas, the Nick Mercs, like all fucking top tier fucking Warzone players that are fucking good. Yep. A- on top of that, being excellent personalities and 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 whatever. I hope that they stick around. I, I, I don't want them to get discouraged. In fact, I want them to pick up like two pro players to play. I want each of them to captain teams. That way they can have like that sort of backup. I think that that's going to be like yeah. the way to go. What I do you mean stick around like after this tournament yeah, and keep playing? Yeah, yeah. dude. Yeah. Like, I mean, I, you know me. That's, that's like my favorite type of tournament. Like the, I threw like a crack creator tournament where it's like it was content creators, 16 content creators. They teamed up with another pros. player that were like oh. basically pros of Warzone. Yeah. And there's just, it's just so entertaining. Yeah. Because as much as I like watching the three best, like, you know, eight and Super Heavy, yeah, yeah, yeah. like watching them play, it is cool to like incorporate the people that everyone is like, the, the people with the fan bases that are gigantic. Yeah, the, yeah, the, the ones that are relatable. Right, right, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is why, I mean, it all, everything all stems back to like Friday Fortnite. Because Friday Fortnights were the shit. They, like yeah. everyone watched yeah. those. To this day, one of the best esports moments in competition was when Ninja, mm-hmm. where his partner dies, and Ninja goes on this insane run with the LMG, yeah. and it's just like, too, like I, I just watched it like last month, because it was that insane of a moment, yeah. and maybe it's because I watched it live, yeah. and I couldn't believe that someone was that fucking good, that I was just like, It was like me. early, that was like right before, and it was like right before things just went crazy with Fortnite yeah. too, because the meta at that time was still kind of like ramp, ramp, wall, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and shoot. And then at the time, Ninja and Myth were just like, fuck Yeah, it. yeah. And then Tifu Closey came along, and it just got crazy after that. Yeah. Oh, my God. It was one of those Well, actually, where... I think they were, he was against T- Tifu and Closey that match. I think, I think it was against Tifu and Closey that he did that. Was it? Because I think King Richard died in, what is it? Uh, Tilted Towers? Yeah. King Richard died in Tilted Towers, and then, he, and then Ninja got 23 kills. Jesus. Bro, it, it was one of the, the craziest fucking runs I've ever seen. Anyway, I, I, I'm, I'm confident in the team that, that we have put together. Hopefully, they uh, they can do above anything else. Like I think they're gonna they're gonna have a lot of fun, and they they're gonna yeah. need you know they, they they're gonna need those those sort of breaks in between. And I hope that I hope that more people oh, in yeah. the pro scene like get involved in that because if you pair God, be so if you pair watch. like if you pair like uh, an un, like two unpopular like pros that are like fucking disgusting or up and coming pros that haven't had a chance to develop their brand. If you pair them up with people that are fucking nasty and they have a massive following, that's how you grow that. Yeah. And if we can grab, let's say you pair up, um, uh, you pair up Kleenex and Bands, right? Bands obviously has been around for a long time, but you know what I'm saying? Like, right. if you pair up those two, wait, who else, who else is there? On that team? Kleenex, Bands, Insight, Insight and, and uh, Cammy. Cammy. Oh, God, Cammy's a fucking incredible sniper. 
if you put any of those two with M Nick Merckx, he's they gassing fucking, them up like, yeah, oh and, my yeah, god, yeah, dude, oh my god. Mm -hmm. But I think uh, wouldn't. I mean, you got to think like Tommy and Rated's blow up, like uh, yeah. Blast blow up, like all these guys are blowing up, and it's because of those situations. The way they play with like other people. That, yeah, like, like, Blast has been playing with Tifu a lot lately. Right. Yeah, so. Blast has been playing with Tifu. Rated played a tournament with Nate and like carry him yeah. through the whole to finals. Yeah. And it's like situations like that are like those are amazing. I mean, the best. I, I honestly the best example of that is Z Zlaner. Yeah. Plays with Doc. Every tournament, and instead of playing with these other, he could play yeah. with anyone. Yeah. He's one of the best. Because if you win, it's like you're like right. If you God. win, with, I mean, if you win with Doc, <laughs> you're yeah. God. you got the whole Champions exactly. Club watching you. Yeah, so. yeah, yeah. So I'm I'm excited for for that sort of uh, opportunity just to develop. Because if those two get big, then that means that you know those fans are going to start to right, listen. I'm giving out free tips out here. Please listen. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, we're gonna take a quick uh, break, and in that break, we're gonna give you a preview of one of the coolest things that we have shot. Out of the hex quarters, call the truth pond. Let's see the preview. So, we're gonna win though. <laughs> I die. Holy! Shit. How about we get first shot yeah. because we fucking cool. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Yeah. You actually want to eye to eye me? I'm not ready. You go. God shit! You guys are great. Holy shit! These guys are shot. Dip it into water. These like, guys we really can really yeah. 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 Yeah
is my huge 1v144 gets undertoned by his 1v3 close to that was a good 5-4. Nobody remembers that. Yeah, that's a good clutch. <laughs> 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 you you did. That was a big clutch. That was a big clutch. You are pretty good at 1v1. Yeah. That's loose for 1v1. Oh, yeah. You do. Ooh. Yes. Uh, <laughs> uh, Throw his under the lights. What's Remember? the most you've ever Remember paid in taxes? Remember when I was out of bricks? It was a 1v2 to kill me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I just fucking choked. <laughs> that's not good. I thought I got a two-piece round left. You can't clutch them all. 200 in taxes? How much did you make that year? Holy shit. Wait, what? A millionaire? What was the person? It was, it was, what's your opinion, Jackson? I wish Seth would have got that. Yeah, I really wish Seth would have got that shit. <laughs> Get it? You're rich? Yeah, was it? Heating up. That's, that's one cup out of the way. Let's fucking go. We're He's winning. Heating up. <laughs> Wait, you made two in a row? Wow. And look at that, just like that. Look, I, I, I'm, I'm glad that I wasn't there because there's nothing but buckets if I'm there. You know what I'm saying? As long as Nick wasn't your partner, you would have done good. Wait, why? Oh, he was your partner. Watch the video. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! All right. So it's my my favorite part. Big timer. Have you been here this whole time? Yes. Okay. Cool. Yes, just making sure. I feel like I've, I've. Not giving you your time to shine. Yeah, you Yo, know, I'm just. Wait, show, I want to ask Will show, a question. Show, show the, show What's the, the insider info. Show the branding. Show what? Show the branding. The, the tattoo. Ooh, yes. yes. So did you, you guys, tattoo. did you see that Nate got 60-50 yeah. on his knuckles? Did you, like, I mean, think about what, in his head, the first Optic House, or the Optic House, 60-50 Russell Drive, right? Yep. Fucking a decade later, gets investment. Gets this fucking massive, you know, investment. Now he's got this dope ass uh, sixty fifty again, and that then and then he insane. gets his facility, and the address to the facility is also sixty. That's so fucking. In that's LA. actually insane. That is so fucking. What are the odds? Are there any mathematicians in chat? That's like billions, like like scenarios. Yeah. Looks like this is a simulation. Literally, like, yeah. tri even probably trillions. Like, yeah. I don't yeah. even know. That's yeah. That's not it, hey, bro. It's so crazy. Anyway, uh, so obviously he texted the, the the group chat. I'll get the tattoo. I'm not getting it on my knuckles. Though. Why? What's the what's what's the problem? I don't. That shit just wouldn't look right on me. I don't know. It probably looks cool on him. I just look fucking goofy. <laughs> I don't feel tattoos. the same way. <laughs> I feel the same way. I'd get one, two, three, five. Some. I'm probably going to get it somewhere. Well, I mean, you were in sixty fifty. Nope. Did you sleep there? I slept there. Why? Hold up. If I got 60-50 on my skin, everybody would be like, you traitor. You think You're so? You're a poser. Yes, I'm not, I didn't live there. I watched the videos. I was watching 60-50 videos in the Walgreens stock room. Oh, bro. You I know do what both. I, I just don't know where You know I what's them. fucking crazy? I went back and watched the podcast that we did where we were talking about Venom and how he got the autograph from me and Nature. Right. And then later he's like sitting there and you were like, you, when you said it's like, yeah. It's like, when you tweeted afterwards, it's like 2013 me wouldn't have like thought that this was a thing where you, it's like you're sitting there with me, Nate, Chad, and Scum. You tweeted it afterwards. Yeah, yeah I put right? it on like, Instagram. I didn't, it, it didn't click, because obviously you were, you've been with us for like fucking 10 years yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. So it didn't click the same thing, but you had to have been like, it does. I mean, that's of, the first, that's the first podcast I think. Yeah, it's the first podcast I've ever done with Nate. It's like, might be, might be the first time I've ever done content with Nate, actually. And I didn't think about it until afterwards. Really? Yep. Yeah. Because... I mean, oh, that's crazy. I was though. watching. I mean, I was yeah. watching Nate videos in like Modern Warfare Two. Like, yeah, so, but, but I did, it didn't click in my head until you tweeted out. I'm like, holy fuck, this dude yeah. had been watching the videos, and now he's like there. <clears throat> yep. Yeah, crazy. Do you have any any Have you had any of those moments? I was fucking the man from the beginning. Right. That's what I'm saying. Like, I, I I found a video. God damn it. I, <laughs> can I be cool like that? I found a video on my old. Uh, on that I on my old channel where I was like, uh, "Who's your codfather?" and I was yeah, going yeah. around to asking people, and like everyone said Rambo, and then I asked Will, and he was like, "I am the codfather." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't think I had a codfather. Did you have a codfather, George? Do you have a codfather? Mm, you gotta say somebody. I was given a chance by like there you go my my local my local friends like when I first started but not really like a but like somebody father. who like taught you cutoffs and taught no, you what, I, nothing I, like that I'm really self taught nice I mean honest. yeah that makes sense that mm -hmm. does make sense first <laughs> first first team to come to open bracket yeah, and make yeah, it win yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I was given a chance by like my first team but I remember do you uh, I mean yeah was that UMG DC no uh, Cali, uh, Cali? Uh, California dude 
I remember watching in the stands and I was like, who the fuck are these guys? <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> and they were shitting on well, Optic. I said the same thing. I was backstage with Jack. And then this dude sits down and I was like, yo, good fucking job. He's like, thanks. He goes like this and I'm like, was that a fucking Rolex? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yeah. Who the fuck are you? Well, if I time out. Yeah, uh, I'm here. Yeah. That shit was crazy, man. That was That's like a moment in COD that not a lot of people talk about. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that CTF- another documentary, okay? No, are you fucking writing them The best also? CTF game Ever, in probably, history. Yeah. Besides yeah, maybe the, the standoff yeah. guys. Yeah. Uh-huh. You guys, <laughs> bro, this guy I'm like, out of nowhere. I'm like, they, they're in the then the, the crowd was fucking going super wild. Too. Which game was this? Was it, was, it, it was funny because there was a A-W. there was an A-W. article because we were like we were like on like a 13 like online tournament win streak and like we were people. This guy made an article saying, "Oh, can these guys be optic?" And everyone laughed at it. And they they, they were gonna it. be we're gonna be like horrible horrible land or whatever like complete just onliners. Yeah. And then That's we just come through open right. bracket and handle business. I remember you got it because, dude, that was the best way. I miss lands. I, I miss, miss. I mean, I miss open. lands, well, but no. I miss open brackets. I mean, yeah. I just, I just miss actually, like you know, be able to you know qualify. You know, but yeah, yeah, <laughs> we're not, we can't do that anymore. But <laughs> we can't do that anymore. We can't do that anymore. Like going through, but seeing yeah, going a team through, just going yeah. to run and then they make it to group play. Yeah, doing all that work just to make it to groups, like that yeah. shit's. It's tough. That's like wild. A, I can't like, even imagine. I met many even pros to this day, like they cannot do that open bracket grind there's like, no it's, way you, it's 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 very hard like and a lot of my tournaments i actually just made it i would make it through open bracket yeah you know yeah like, yeah, yeah. and just so. keeping up with who's doing well in open bracket i remember watching in like open. halo and knowing who was like the 16th seed and they make it in there open. and then you watch them play against the pro team right. open bracket like, is so it, it was it's not tough because the players you play but like you can't even hear your teammates because like yeah. you're playing on the side right next to the speaker of yep. main stage and you're just like, boom. Yeah. Like, <laughs> did, in, in Black Ops 2, didn't you guys like, have to play split screen in open bracket one time? I think so, yeah. Oh, my, I would have lost. I it remember you were, tweeting out, you were tweeting out uh, updates about it because y'all, I think it was Anaheim, one of them you guys had to get like top four or something in order yeah. to make it to chance. Yeah. You had to do that or play league play, and you guys were like, "Fuck that league play shit." Yeah. So you guys were just making it top four, but you had to start an open bracket. Yeah. And I was Damn. like, "What the?" Hell? Those were the good old days, man. Good old days. days. All right. So we have a couple of uh, closing <laughs> comments here in the breakdown as we end the show and send you over to the uh, CDL thing, right? Yes. Uh, last last week, Afro's uh, uh, Royal Ravens debut, right? Last yep. week, and he carried. Alex returns to the, uh, also returns to the. Is this yeah. right? Yeah, Alex and it's Afro. two different sentences. Yeah, that you read. It is two different sentences, right? Yes. Okay, I wasn't reading the story. Separate thought. Yeah, yeah. So you were saying <laughs> Alex and Afro, yeah. They're... Alex and Afro, yeah, going absolutely off. This mm-hmm. is a thing, bro. This is a thing. This is what this is a team owner speaking here. The investment that it takes to have a contender team today. It's minimal, especially because they're up and coming dudes that are just like hot to yeah. prove themselves. Mm-hmm. And you're talking about the confidence of youth, the love of the game of the youth, which is like the most. When, when, you, when you play for a decade or more, you sort of lose a little bit of the passion for it. I don't know how Seth and Formal or like some of the other like long standing pros. I don't know how they're doing that. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I mean. Because like you can, you can still tell, right? Like you, you can still tell. And then. Uh, I, I was looking at a chart of of like engagements, like first first battle engagements, first one we won, and like Seth's performance is like way the fuck out there still. Oh yeah, right. I'm just like I cannot still believe like, first man this, in this this uh this late in the game, you know, like 13 years in the game. It's to be able to have that focus on the same thing because a lot of people, I think, even when he quits, he will still be that competitive at something. Yeah, it doesn't go away. But for him to channel that competitiveness. Only on COD for that long is like, dude. If they played, I mean, thank God they don't because we have jobs. But if they played Warzone at that yeah. level, it yeah. would be fucking insane. Yep. Yeah. Because even just watching us, what was that thing we did the other day? Or was just like that little like uh, within optic like oh the, the Family Feud. Yeah, I mean, all you see is the, the pro players are outperforming the 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 professional. Warzone players that yeah. we well, I mean, brought it's, in. That's because like professional Warzone players are like always like playing against pop kids, and then right, the yeah, pro yeah. players are literally playing against like literally like yeah, yeah. like people that like dashies and yeah, people like that, that, that don't, don't miss. miss. Yeah, yeah. So. it's wild. I mean, yeah, but you're right. I'm, that's why I'm surprised you never like. I mean, you started making money, but 
I know you never like. Well, that went was, out that's like, what I was getting to. Is like you. I'm still super competitive. I just channel that in different ways. Like I'm super into trading or super into fucking whatever golf. Or Do you look at all the traders and like? Oh, so <laughs> so trading to you is like competition. Oh, it's yeah. <laughs> You like, just got like a fire in your eyes. He's got the inside of your phone. Oh, it's the the phone bigger than COD. It's like the most brutal fucking oh, is war it? there oh, is every I day. I thought it was just like, I'm going to try this, try this, uh, make gonna, money here. I go to fucking battle every morning at 8.30, bro. <laughs> <laughs> every morning. <laughs> every morning. Every morning. There in the robe that he always wears. <laughs> 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 his little chest hair coming That's out. And a little fucking coffee. Yeah, he's like, what What's your setup? What's your setup look like? Uh, we got the three monitors. No, no, no. I, I, I get all that shit. Like, what are you, your setup? Like, do you have a coffee, yeah. a pen? Do you chew on? Yeah, this? I do some coffee. I try to do a smoothie too. And yeah, I try not to do too much coffee because, like, when you're in a trade and you got that much money on the line, like, the adrenaline starts fucking pumping and so the heart's going. Are you so, like, serious? You, oh, Holy yeah. shit. It's fucking nuts. But everybody to... will find something like that. If it's yeah, not yeah, trading, yeah. Well, you like, also yeah, got to yeah. think about the amount of money he's playing with. Well, I mean, yeah, but I, I just didn't know it was. Yeah. Competitive, I guess. I didn't, yeah. I've never. Well, no one wants to lose. Nothing about it. Yeah. Like, like, so, like, if you lose money, I mean, like, you lose, but you lose money. Like, you know what I mean? Right. Yeah. So it's like it's a video game that's played for money. That's IRL. exactly how yeah. I look at trading. Oh, I'm su I'm super competitive too. So I hate. Why did you invest in AMC? I, I shorted yeah. it. Wait, what did you ask him? Because <laughs> AMC went up. Oh, but you the shorted it. The moon. The apes are strong. Yeah. <laughs> it was Sixty, right? Sixty this morning. 60, 70, I I think it was, it was, it uh, yeah, I thought it went up. It was fucking crazy. Yeah. Danger. He's just not giving you advice, guys. He's just fucking no, showing you the way. Never. All advice. right, let's get into <laughs> the, the fun part. Here we go. Uh, I'm going to give you the rankings just so we can uh, recap. Atlanta Face at the number one spot. New York Sobliners at the number two spot. Dallas Empire at the number three. Corona Ultra at number four. And we'll end it at number five with Optic Chicago uh, being 30 points ahead of the Los Angeles Thieves. Thieves. Mm -hmm. All right. So on Saturday, which is uh, when you guys are watching this, Right? All right. So today we have uh, the first match is going to be us versus the Paris Legion. Right? That's, so all we, three, that's all we got this weekend, right? At 3 30. Yeah. yeah. So it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a mini, mini short weekend for us. Uh, but yeah, we have uh, the Paris Legion uh, versus Optic Chicago, Chi Town, Chi Tizzle. Uh, sorry. Also, the, the marquee players. match this week is... Oh, I'm sorry. Keep going. Keep no, I was, I was apologizing because my chain was... I was... I was. So if we just win that match, how many points do we get? Uh, 10 points. That's it? That's it. 10 points, which really does nothing, right? Because yeah, we get to 220. Gonna four, Toronto Ultra is obviously going to win, so they're going to go to 245, et cetera, et cetera. I mean, the, the point, think about this, bro. Think about... The Atlanta phase is 150 points ahead of us. That's 15 matches ahead of us. That's a lot of points. That That's is nuts. a lot of points. That is really nuts. Uh, you know, in, in the in in the Those are some good ass in the players. interest of time, we're just gonna go straight into the uh, the predictions, and then we're gonna send it over to the CDL team because we're running out of time. Yeah. Uh, Hitch, what say you? Legion versus Shy Tizzy Ooh. Optic. I think three zero. I think we need a three zero. We need I a think that's what we're gonna get. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Say three. I say three one us. Three one us. Which one do you think we lose? Maybe search. No, I think we're good in search. I mean, we're good, but the, the newest standoff with a new standoff map that came in, so people are gonna like either pick that one or pick a weaker map that they yeah. know what team you're playing against. Mm -hmm. Yo, shout out to the casters who keep calling the Optic Van the Optic Van. I like that. I see all of y'all, dude. I, I, imagine I was talking about on stream. Imagine like they put like an Easter egg where it's like the license plate just says. Actually, it also depends on how the vetoes go because <laughs> like. That'd with so with either Hardpoint uh, Garrison or Hardpoint Apocalypse. So we'll see how Paris plays that. They're not going to play it well. I say 3-0 Optic. 3-0 <laughs> Optic. 3-0 Optic. I say 3-0 Optic. We were talking about that last week, how Call of Duty doesn't do what Counter-Strike does with the, with yeah. the sprays. We definitely for that? should. No, no, no. no, no they did that in BO4. Did they? The sprays. Yeah, in BO4. Remember the chicken? Oh, yeah, no. Yeah. But, yeah. No, yeah. no. He was talking about, like, oh, you know how on Cold the map. Zero, yeah, yeah, on the map. Oh, like, okay. Cold Zero's, you know, four. Hit the, that's the only one I know. <laughs> like, yeah, that's the only one of graffiti that on there. I, I do. I did say that, right? Like, if they is had it like, like his name or something on it, or what is it that's on? It's the like map? A, yeah, it's his signature. Oh, okay. kind of. It's like it, it's like graffiti. It, you wouldn't notice it unless you know it's there, yeah. which is like the coolest part. So what I was saying is that they should have they should have had like big timers and and Nate Shot's face or something like Big T and Big T and Nate Shot's plumbing service. Right, so, right. You know, like an Easter oh, egg, okay. like you, you said. Oh, right? so you would already talk yeah, about yeah, it? Yeah, oh, yeah. shit. Yeah, yeah. I, I was just thinking, like, if they just made the license plate 60 feet. Yeah. Like, the the thing is, just like, like, they have so the license to, you know, the, the, the word optic. 
right? right yeah, yeah. So they could, in theory, call it the optic van if they wanted to, or put right. the license plate OPTC. Or just make it green. Or just make it green. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? Something. something. That would cool. be crazy. Uh, I, I think that they I think they will. At one point or another, they got their, they're going to get their shit together. <laughs> if we keep talking about it enough, they'll do it. Yeah, if they, they're going to get their, 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 their shit. Not that they don't have it together, okay? That's funny. Don't find me. You're going to have to find me first. All right, uh, and then we have Seattle Surge versus the Minnesota Rocker. I think this is a very easy one to to call it. Yeah. Who do you got? Uh, Rocker 3-1. Rocker 3-1? Yeah. Uh, chat, I hope that you guys are also inputting in the comment section what you guys' prediction is for this one. So, 3-1 Rocker, who do you got there? I'm going last map for the Rocker. Last map, Three, really? 2 yeah. Rocker. I'm gonna that, that one's going to be a sweaty one. Yeah. I mean, Sur wait, Surge kind of fights in their series. They just choke. Yeah. the thing That's the thing, right? Like, every team is scary if they don't do that one mistake that yeah. costs them the game. I think Seattle Surge is, like, in that very no, specific... they fight in their series, yeah. yeah. they're in that very specific spectrum where the one thing that's missing from their, their, their game is just not making that one small mistake or not making that yeah. one push. Admittedly, I there. haven't watched a lot of their matches, so like just looking at the stats is not telling no. of the whole no. story. I mean, that's the kind of general stats. Don't really tell. Yeah. Like, so someone can have a point nine, but they get the game-winning two-piece, and right. they don't shoot their gun, and they literally right. like, shoot you in the back. Like. But 4 and 16 just seems... Oh, no. I know. Yeah, yeah. Dreadful. <laughs> no, it is no, dreadful. It is dreadful. That's going to be... A, I mean, I think LAG versus Mutineers is going to be a good, good series. Is there, yeah. is there, a, is there a world... In which you can see Seattle Surge beating. Uh, I mean, we saw LAG beat Face. They're like the number ninth team That's beat the true. number one team, right? Mm -hmm. So it's like it's all situational. Anyway, who do you who do you, what do you got? Uh, Surge I'll, or say, Rocker? I'll say Rocker too. All right, I'm gonna say Rocker three one. Uh, Los Angeles Gorillas versus Florida Mutineers. Hitch. Uh, I'm going LAG for that. LAG chat. What do you guys three, have? Three two. Yeah. And what's the score? So three two LAG. What do you got? I have us three. I have not. Uh, Mutineers three one. Mutineers 3-1? Same. Florida homestand. Florida takes it. Florida takes it. What's the score? 3-1. 3-1. I'm going to say 3-1 like the rest of the chat saying 3-1. Uh, the guy that said Gorillas, I see you and I, I appreciate the, the support. All right. Los Angeles Thieves versus Atlanta Face. Who you got? Uh, Atlanta Face 4-0. 4-0 Atlanta <laughs> Who do you got? Uh, Atlanta Face 3-2. I think that'll go last map. You do? Yeah. You think TJ's dial-in is, is going to be there? I don't know, like, individually, I, I just think that series just, I don't know, they, they're, they're both, like, really aggressive teams, so the matchups between them, I think it's going to be a close one. Red versus red, man, I like it. Who, it what red you versus think? red. Uh, I say 3-1 phase over LA. It's a tough team to beat Atlanta. I'm going to go with big timer 3-1 LA. That's uh, the Sunday matches and, of course, the marquee match of the last, uh, or the weekend, Dallas Empire versus the New York Subliners. Who do you got? You know what? Say it. Ian's coming through. Ian's going to three two through 3-2. Who do you got? Dallas. Yeah, 3-1 New York. 3-1 New York? What, chat? I'm, I'm keeping tabs. Who? Um, I'm going to be honest. I did not know New York was number two. They're disgusting. Yeah, they're, <laughs> really disgusting? they're really good at hard point. They're really good at hard point, yeah. And Dallas is not doing too hot right, right. now. But this week it changes. This week it changes. Um, Dude, I'm go Ray, with New York. Ray's watching. New York. Ray, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go with uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna go with you. I'm gonna say uh, Dallas Empire. Really? Uh, three two. I think three, they're gonna two. go last. But I think I think Ian's gonna turn it around. Mr. Porter himself, the crim bot. Let's uh, end it right there. Everybody, any closing comments? You guys want to say anything? Hello, is anything? Shout out Mavix. Hey, we're good. Shout out uh, Game Fuel. Shout out Scuff. Shout out uh, our merch. <laughs> like I'm like Ron Burgundy Armor <laughs> With that we're going to end it Thank you so much for tuning in If you guys enjoyed it Please leave a like on the video Also hit the link in the description Go over there Tell them who sent you Gosh darn it Oh is that Do we do this Damn.